Hey, how's it going everyone? Today I'm going to be showing you a new rune farm spot, specifically to this first one's going to be the fastest way to acquire runes in the latest patch. So let's get into where and how this is done. So where do you need to go? You need to arrive at Across the Roots. We are not going to be doing the same method essentially. We are going to completely skip the whole entire method where we have to hop from one route to the other. We are just going to simply get straight to the drop point. So from the Lost Grace across the routes, you can then travel across this route, no pun intended. Then we wanna take a right, then jump on this route here. As you make your way up here, you'll see my gold runes. What we are going to do is drop and then double jump and make sure as you hit the route that you're constantly hitting the jump button so that way you are on top of it. Follow exactly where I go and right here we are going to then double jump, land right here, then double jump again and now you're across. You have skipped the whole entire method where we need to go around, get on top of the route, then go towards the jumping portion to get behind the barrier and all that. So this method is going to be by far the easiest way that you can do this. Now, do not forget we are going to be getting into the other method that I just mentioned. This is going to be mainly for those that want the items in this location easily. It's not just for the main purpose of rune farming. This one is indeed a great rune farming spot. Just continue to slash away and as you do this, you will notice after a, I don't know, 30 seconds to 40 seconds, you'll notice the runes will start to come at you or drop towards you. This is because the map is unloaded, so the enemies are falling through. This can actually yield you quite a lot. I was able to get almost half a mil. This is because some of the enemies were glowing eyes, as well as I've had some additional buffs. I've had some extra stuff there, so just note that one down. Additionally, I'm also, you know, new game plus. Yet, Still, regardless, this is a great spot if you are a new player because if you cannot get to the Snowfield Consecrated or the Consecrated Snowfield, sorry, then this method might be valuable for you or vital. So let's arrive back at the Deep Roots and rinse and repeat it. This is me doing this again, so I'm at a million runes. And this is what I was able to acquire within an hour. You can definitely definitely gain a lot through this especially if you do use the buffs and you do indeed get a few of those glowing enemies to drop let's now talk about the second new glitch that you can do to acquire not just runes but the items from the main bosses because they will fall through using this method so this one is a lost grace that's located right next to the finger lady and this is right before you get to across the roots but yeah, you can just jump from these roots to the other, and as you can tell, we are on top of this tree, so we can jump from this main route to those other ones. And how is this possible? Well, it's quite easy. So, as you can tell, right behind us, there is a route that leads straight up. If you jump towards that and it continues to jump, you can continuously go up and up until you're on the top of the route. Here we can then jump around this sort of intertwined route, and we can then proceed up. As you continue to go up, you can then take the left path. Uh, eventually, I will uh, get there. Uh, but yet, yeah, here we are. We're right there. Now, let's jump to the left. And bada boom. So, from there, you can head west. And we are going to double jump off the ledge or off of the route. And continue to swing. And you'll be able to acquire easy items. I hope that you guys have enjoyed the video for today's glitches. If you are not subscribed, feel free to feel free, feel free, feel free to subscribe, turn on those notifications for all, join our Discord if you want. Other than that, I hope that you all are having a great day out there, a great Memorial uh, weekend or a Monday or whichever it was for you, whichever day that you decided to celebrate early or afterwards. So yeah, just have a great day out there and cheers. I'll see you all in the next one.